I'm feeling pretty fast. Yeah, you good. can see that that I just touched the you can see it's right eroding here. that and that makes it get bigger just and bigger like and the bigger. water just erodes all the sand and, and, and then like the trees start all falling the in because it's still eroding that's why I'm and then the right. so all the rain is going mm-hmm. and now it's dangerous because since it's right by the lake the lake is overflowing now but when i took the jetties away all the water went back uh, to me i want to see what happens when um the leaves get bigger while we knew what we had was great stuff and something innovative we've never seen before, we felt like as we were going through it, there was something missing. What would be the next step for that? And your new experience is just, that's what we were missing. You can now, like the beach one that we just looked at, you see it happening and you can control it. You can see over time the changes and that's what we were missing. Well, and what I love about the experiences is that it is the next step that I cannot do, I cannot replicate it without the Z-Space technology. Without Z-Space, the experiences wouldn't happen. The beach road, watching the fish crawl out and being able to control that over time, seeing change over time, would not happen without this technology. When you get to use it in the classroom, it's really cool. Instead of, you know, just getting like pen and paper, you actually get to control what you're doing and you get to see all of the different combinations you can make. Learning in virtual reality is better than just watching a video because it's like hands-on but like in Z-Space you can really do whatever you want. This is something awesome that is going to extend what you're already doing Mm -hmm. and make it easier for the kids to understand what you're doing so the learning is going to attach better because they're not only just reading it in a book, they're experiencing it. Good point. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs>